Hey everyone, it's Josh with Shift Worship. We've had a lot of people asking lately, how do I add my own font within the Quick Editor? In the Quick Editor, you're able to customize any collection, pretty much do anything you want to a collection by adding elements and changing the words. A little bit easier than just using Photoshop or After Effects. Um, so I'm going to launch the Quick Editor here in um, this Color Waves collection, which is one of our more popular collections from the last year. Uh, we're going to see we're going to get to an edit place here where we can move the text around, we can change the size, obviously change for what we want it to say. Um, down here is where all your fonts are, and you'll see your recommended fonts or the alternatives. These are basically the fonts that come preloaded that you can use whenever. Uh, due to licensing, there's a limit to what we can actually provide, uh, but there's no limit to what you can bring in. So your fonts is a really something you should harness um, and it makes it pretty fun. So advanced, you want to click right here, advanced, and this is where you're going to bring in your custom fonts. Very important, you need a TTF or OTF file for this. Pretty common extensions for fonts. So I want to show you how this process works. Go up here to, um, there's, there's hundreds of websites that pro provide fonts, free or paid. Um, this is Defont, so a pretty common one. This is, uh, let's just grab this script font here, just for example purposes. Um, we're gonna download it. You'll notice it comes in a zip folder. We double click on that, it opens up the, this is an OTF extension. Once it's here, you wanna just double click that OTF and you'll see that we need to click this install font right here. This is an important step. If you miss this step, it's not gonna work. Don't just drag that into the, into the quick editor, it won't recognize it. We need to install it first. Once it's installed, you'll see it lives right here. We still don't want to drag it from this window. We want to go back to the window here and drag that. So what we're going to do is open up our um, quick editor again. We're going to grab the folder and drop it right there. And you'll see, because I already have the text highlighted, it changed the text right there. So now we can, again, we can customize, make it bigger, smaller. Um, we can drop, put a drop shadow on it. Maybe in the elements folder, we wanna drag um, a logo in here. And maybe we wanna put a, uh, some stylizing and we could grab a box and drop that across it all for this week. So lot that you can do the sky's the limit pretty much any element you want to bring in any sizing anything like that so that's how you add fonts if you have questions give us a shout send us an email um, give us a call and have fun